beautiful sweets, sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day, afternoon, evening, whatever time you're watching this video. I just had a small little quick Dollar Tree haul and a little food line haul that I wanted to share with you guys real quick. When I went out to take my cousin um, one of my sour cream pound cakes for the family, I just ran by food line trying to get some healthy stuff. This is all the stuff I went to Walmart for yesterday and couldn't find. Even the red grapes at food line weren't looking that hot. So I got to wash these. They are filthy. But I'll start over here since I'm over here. I got an avocado. I got two plum tomatoes. Um, one head of lettuce, which was nice to see. It's only $1.28 at food line. Still $1.78 at Walmart's, if they have any, they didn't have any yesterday. I got a couple of Honeycrisp apples and a couple of Sunkiss oranges because I only eat like a half to a quarter of these at a time because of my sugar. I got a cucumber, one lemon, some mushrooms, and of course, yeah, I paid $2 for these at Food Line. They were $1.78 at Walmart's, but I only found one bag at Walmart's yesterday, so... I just got another bag of these because I love these Doritos. So that's my little quick um, food line haul. Then I ran over to the Dollar Tree or right down the road to the Dollar Tree. And I found a couple of new items, some old items that they restocked and some stuff. I wanted to get my balsamic vinaigrette dressing, but I haven't seen that on our Dollar Tree shelves in I don't know when. Hopefully, they'll get them back. If not, I have to remember to get them at the grocery store if they have it. Because I'm telling you, these shelves here in North Kakalaki have been barren. But I did find the new um, Old El Paso World Taco Kits. And I really, really saw When I saw these on other people's channels, I'm like, oh, I hope we get them. Because I love tacos. And I love different kinds of tacos. So this one is the Japanese-inspired teriyaki and I think this one expires in, let's see, February. Can we see that? Yeah, February 22nd of 2022. So I have to use this one first. And then this, this one is the Old World Caribbean Inspired Jerk Chicken. Ah, that sounds good, y'all. But of course, you know, you can put in anything you want. This expires March 3rd, my birthday. Ooh, 2022. I didn't even see that in the store when I looked. I saw March, but I didn't see March 3rd. Anywho, I digress. <laughs> Y'all remember that day? March 3rd? No, <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> and they restocked the apples. And y'all know I was trying so hard not to buy them because I'm on that no cluttering up my home anymore. But they're just so pretty. I sent Susan four of these. I don't see her anymore. I don't hear from her that often anymore. But I still remember her. And I hope and pray that everything's okay with her and mom. But yeah, I they had the green, the red, the gold, and the white. I started to get the red and the gold. But then I thought about my mommy. And her favorite color was green. <laughs> so... I got red and green. Who knows? I may go back if they still have them and get the gold and the white one. You never know because these are just nice little centerpieces and they're so well made for only a dollar. You know, I'm just like, these are so pretty. And I loved having my apples. So, anywho, I found this new Lipton. It says, uh, no artificial colors, flavors, or sweeteners. This is pineapple mango. And it says, Pure cane sugar, sweetened with pure cane sugar. And I said, ooh, it says it makes one pitcher. So I was like, oh, okay, let me try that. I'll try that. <laughs> and then I found these nuts, nuts, cashew, almond duo, both very healthy for you, gluten-free, best by October 27, 2023. And it is a two ounce package. And I purchased two of them because, yeah, I love to nosh on nuts. Even though I got all these walnuts and pecans over here, believe me, I'll take handfuls of those things at a time and eat them because nuts are really good for you. And I did go back and get that book, you guys. Don't give a fig. <laughs> Shiitake happens. I think this is so funny. And they had a couple when I was there the last time, but they only had one. Recess, much obey little. Okay, I don't get that one. But anyway, I did go back and get it. So I'll be skimming through that. 
I broke all of my little small or medium little clips like this. So I kept forgetting to check the Dollar Tree to see if they had. These were the exact ones I was looking for. And so they had the three pack for a dollar. I was like, yes, let me get those when I'm separating my hair and trying to, you know, whew, moisturize and detangle this stuff. Oh my God. Then I saw these cute little clips here. These are bobby pins. Fashion, you get two. One says sweet, one says XOXO. And they both got me. <laughs> sweet Sadie J and XOXO. Two of my favorite things. So I had to get it. And then I found this Armor All Disinfectant Wipes. This is up at the register and it was only one left. And it says cleans and disinfects in one step. Kills COVID-19. Yeah, uh-huh, sure. Okay, so you get um, how many in here? La, 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 la. I don't see how many. They don't tell you. Am I missing it, you guys? Because I'm trying to... Oh, you get 10, 10 wet wipes in here for a dollar. So I was like, oh, this is cool because I'm always using my antibacteria wipes to wipe down my steering wheel and, you know, everything else in there. So if they had to have more, I probably would have purchased a couple of more packs of these. But I'll look at the other stores later. But I got one for now. And then they had this... Be Pure. They're coming out with a lot of Be Pure products. This is the cuticle oil and nail strengthener. And my nails are so weak and so chippy, you know. And I, I was like, you know what? I really need a professional um, manicure, but I hate going to nail salons, y'all. I really do. So, in the meantime, in between time, I figured I'd get this and try this, see if it doesn't help my dry, brittle nails because. <laughs> Yeah, I'm rough on my nails, so it's not my nails' fault. But that is it, you guys. That is a real quick little Dollar Tree and Food Line haul. I'm getting ready to make me a BLT, hence the lettuce and the tomato. And I made some turkey bacon earlier today. And I got that in my little piglet container that I got from Cracker Barrel. And I'm getting ready to make me a BLT and have some dinner and finish watching the Panthers get beat up. Okay, anyway, I digress. <laughs> Hey, my sweets, I forgot about this small little Dollar Tree haul that I had, y'all. I put the bag down over there on the floor in my living room and completely, completely forgot about it. So I'm going to add it on to this one. These are some items that I found at my large um, Dollar Tree on Raleigh Road in Henderson, North Carolina. And I know already that I have other lip scrubbers and <sighs> lip oils and stuff. But like I've told you guys before, they're in that room, <laughs> like Kathy says, off of No Guts, No Glory. Hey, Kathy. <laughs> I can't find anything right now. It, yeah, that's another whole video. Anyway, I saw this. This is by Be Pure. I told you guys, Be Pure is coming out with a lot of different things. This is the mint lip oil, the lip sugar scrub, and then we have the lip scrubber. And I was like, oh, that will fit perfectly into my little cosmetic bags that I just got for giveaway. So, yeah, I've been looking for stuff like that. And then I also found this, the Be Pure Infused Eyebrow Highlighter, which I might keep for myself. I'm not quite sure yet, but I found that one. And it just, you know, the highlighter, I love these. Crayon Illuminate, so again, be pure. And then I found this infused pressed face powder, and they only had this one color, and when you put it on, it comes off like like that. So, I don't know. I'm, I'm not really sure if that's going to work on my complexion, but it's just um, a pressed face powder, so it provides smooth matte finish, sets makeup, and controls shine. So I can always use that control to shine, but it's a cute little um, cosmetic thing, and it looks like that. So I got those. So again, great gifts to put inside those Live Love Lash cosmetic bags or Glam Squad cosmetic bags that I showed you guys. So yeah, just an idea. I got a birthday card for somebody special coming up. I did go back and pull the trigger on getting these travel bags, these men's travel bags for my brothers, either their birthdays or Father's Day. They did like the first two that I gave them. And I like these. 
better than the ones that were in the plastic. These were more stronger, sturdier, and they're easier to clean. So they were by Assured for Men men's travel bags. So I did go ahead and get two of those. And then I don't need any more car fresheners. I know, I know, but I couldn't help it, y'all. They have this odor eliminator by Vantage. Lavender erases foul odors from smoke, mold, food, pets, blah, 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 home, auto, boat, RV, and you get an eight fluid ounce. And I haven't smelled them yet, but yeah, if I don't use them, I can always donate them. So I got this one. This is a new car fresh and it says the same thing. So yeah, I couldn't help it. When I saw that for only a dollar, y'all, I had to get them. And these gloves I have been looking for throughout the entire holidays and before. They haven't had these in a while. Y'all know how they had them in the blue pack before? Well, they brought them back and they look like this nitrile U-pack. And you get six of them. One size fits all, just like the other ones. So they're latex-free, powder-free, snug fit, similar to latex gloves, snag and puncture resistant. So... That's what they say. I should have probably gotten more, but I have a whole thing of gloves up there on my refrigerator, so I really didn't need these. But these are the gloves that I like to use, especially when I'm doing meats, chicken, and stuff like that. Because y'all know, I got a texture problem when it comes to the meats. But yeah, I've, I've got two of these, and I think that's it. If I find any more stuff laying around, <laughs> I'll have to throw it in the hall as well. But I hope you guys... Um, enjoyed watching i am going to insert some pictures at the end of this video um showing you some stuff that i did not get and also i'm going to insert my lunch that i made today my blt because yeah it was off the hizzy y'all but love peace and happiness sweet sage j coming back at you remember guys be kind to each other the world is big enough for us all i love you guys please like comment and subscribe and everyone have a blessed day bye guys Hey you guys, just came back on to show you my dinner, my BLT, a few grapes, and a few little Doritos, and I'm getting ready to go in. Y'all have a blessed day. Bye.